Hello, Zensei here. Today, I'm going to walk you through how to get into orbit in Kerbal Space Program in less than three minutes. This tutorial assumes that you already know how to build a rocket capable of getting into orbit. If you don't, that's okay. You can check out one of my other tutorials, or you can download the craft that I'm using in this video. The link is in the description. Since time is of the essence, let's get right into it. Here's the step-by-step -step process that I use to get into orbit. Turn on SAS by pressing T, then press Z to throttle up to 100%, and then press spacebar to launch. Go straight up at first, and then tilt eastwards. This will be a heading of 90 degrees on the navball. Open up your orbital information display by clicking the maneuver node button at the bottom left. There are two numbers you want to pay attention to here your apoapsis, which is the highest point in your current trajectory, and your time to reach apoapsis. This is how long it will take for you to get to your apoapsis. During your ascent, try to keep your rocket burning as sideways as possible without letting your time to apoapsis start to go down. If your apoapsis or time to apoapsis do start to go down, then you're too sideways. Point your rocket more upwards. Remember, when you go to turn your rocket, make tiny adjustments. If you try turning too aggressively, you might lose control of the rocket and it may flip. Once your apoapsis reaches 70 kilometers, cut your engines by pressing X. Lock on prograde as you travel through the atmosphere to reduce the amount of drag you create. If you notice your apoapsis start to go below 70 kilometers, just burn your engines prograde for a bit to bring your apoapsis back up. Wait until you're about 10 seconds away from apoapsis and then burn prograde to bring your periapsis above 70 kilometers. Once your periapsis is over 70 kilometers, congratulations, you're in orbit. To get back to Kerbin, just burn retrograde until your periapsis drops below 70 kilometers. I like to bring it down to about 45 kilometers. Then the atmosphere will slow your craft down and you will eventually get captured and land on Kerbin. Just don't forget to deploy your parachutes. And that's how you get into orbit in Kerbal Space Program in less than three minutes. If you found this tutorial useful, please give it a like. And if you enjoy this content, feel free to subscribe for more. You could also check me out on Twitch at twitch.tv slash zenseiplays. The link is in the description. With all that said, I want to say thank you very much for watching. And until next time, take care.